So I made a video in the past about this cam chain tensioner and the noise that this engine made and 15,000 mile service. I wasn't inclined to open the engine and find out what the noise was. These, boy, these bikes make noise. We know they do. They, the double R's and the single R's, they make some noise. Some's normal, some... I think it's all normal, but within range. But there's a startup rattle that mine had that really sounded like a bag of nails, uh, especially when it was cold. And so I put on a new cam chain tensioner. They paid for it. Didn't solve the problem. So what I did today was uh, I brought the bike in just for a routine and uh, they put in a manual cam chain tensioner BMW Escondido some guy makes them over there and uh, they put it in and it sounds better on startup so I figured I'd share this with you guys I'm sure you've seen a thousand of these videos but just in my own experience seemed to solve the problem. Not sure it was a problem in the first place. So I didn't think it was a problem in the first place, per se. It wasn't a problem, I don't think, with the performance of the bike or even the reliability, I think the chain was just a little loose and it was smacking around a little bit. Whether or not that would affect anything regarding longevity is just opinion. But it was relatively cheap. It makes me feel a little better. I feel like I have control over that thing. Now you can just tighten it if it loosens up some more. And uh, seems like others have benefited as well. I think there's a couple of different models out there that seem to have worked. You do an online search on the double R forums or there's a single R forum, two out of the UK. It has a lot of info on this, but that's my single experience, the startup rattle, especially cold startup. It just sounds better, and even getting an exhaust with that thing in place, it just, it didn't tempt me because I didn't want to put lipstick on a pig, if you know what I mean. But now that that's gone, I, I may consider putting an exhaust on this thing. We'll see, but uh, so far I'm pleased.